on this computer. Okay, I am Dr. Martoni, and we are going to go over today a very important subject. This is a subject that I get multiple emails about. Um, and so I want to review uh, the break in procedure for the neck nest because how you use the neck nest really is critical in making uh, your experience with the neck nest, I guess you can say, a very favorable one. A neck nest is designed to be used on a nightly basis every single night to be your, your only in best pillow for the rest of your life, but it takes a, a very um, conscientious approach to being able to understand how to use the neck nest to get it right. So when your neck nest comes out of your box, you're going to notice that the neck nest is really firm. It's, it, it, it holds and maintains the two chamber shape very effectively. And because of the, the fill in the neck nest, which is down, it, it, it stays a little bit puffed up. So in, in, in consequently on the picture behind me, I have the picture of somebody using a neck nest during the break in period. So it looks like when you use it, it should be used flat on the bed like this. And when you sleep on it, it most people take the neck nest, put it under their neck, and then they sleep in this position. That is going to be an okay position to get started with. But as the neck nest breaks in, it will, it, the, the way that you use it needs to change. So what I do in, in the instructions I give my patients is I give them a neck nest at the beginning of their treatment plan. And I tell them to use the, the, your neck nest as a back support at the beginning, right? To use it on your couch, to use it in your car, to sit on it, to just break in the firmness of the feathers. And it typically takes about a week to two weeks to really break in a neck nest effectively if you're, if you're using it, if you're, if you're doing it on a daily basis. You can also, when you sleep, you can use a neck nest underneath. Uh, well, well, these are pretty crazy little socks, aren't they? But you can use a neck nest underneath your legs when you sleep as like a leg bolster. I often have people purchase two neck nests, one for their neck and one for their legs to keep their legs elevated. So, so you want to make sure that in the first week or two uh, that you don't, you don't need to actually sleep with your neck nest. I know you're excited to start. A lot of people do, but if you're having a difficult time with the firmness of the neck nest, you can use it underneath your legs and your back. So let's say after two weeks or as the neck nest becomes more flimsy or, or I guess you could say more uh, moldable. That is when you start to change the way that you use your neck nest. And this is what a lot of people don't understand is that when you use a neck nest, the angle of the neck nest is really important to be able to get. And it's not it, 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 it to really be able to get it right after the break-in period. So I have a two-step approach to using a neck nest. The first step is putting your neck nest flat on your bed. And, um, and the second one is to be able to lie down and grab the front edge of the neck nest. If you can see the front edge and just angle it up like this. So it's right on, on your shoulders. And the third step is to just put the roll under your, your neck. And then now the neck nest is tucked between the base of your occiput. The roll is and is, is really nesting or, or hugging your neck. And when you get it right, it should feel almost like a weightless position. You shouldn't have a lot of pressure on the back of your skull. Most of the neck nest is between the base of your skull and within your shoulders and your head is lying lightly over the back of your neck nest. So I really, really hope that this helps explain the break-in process of the neck nest. Like I said, it takes one to two weeks 
And then after that one to two week period, when you start using your neck nest correctly, it also can take another two weeks after that to really break in fully. And that is how you start to break in your neck nest. Thank you for watching.